Storm and you can too. Welcome to day 135. Uh, that was a Friday. That was a fun Friday. I uh, finally had enough of Kevin's bullshit and decided, all right, I'm going to use biting sarcasm right back at you. It seems like every time that you get butt hurt, you decide to use sarcasm. So I'm finally sick of your crap, and I'll use sarcasm right back. He claimed he was in West Des Moines, and because of the way that I was talking to him, he recalled himself back to the store to pick up two measly gallons and deliver it down the street. And I'm sorry, but I'm going to call that a win. Just so sick of him. I wish he would stay home. He needs to stay home. The dude doesn't wash his hands after he goes to the bathroom. We're never going to get out of COVID protocols if he chooses to continue to live like this. I mean, that's just nasty. What a nasty person. But the reason that I had fun today is not because I got to use my sarcasm for justice and peace. But uh, it's the last full work day of us not having Mark and Sean in the store for a while. Despite Leroy going on uh, a little hiatus um, next week. But uh, yeah, um, after work was over, Sean and Simic basically... Uh, together decided that it'd be cool to go across the street and have some drinks and I completely agreed I'm like yeah this sounds awesome so I got a pitcher of beer because you know I'm hi and uh, Sean got Red Bull vodkas Simic got some kind of cup I don't even know um I don't know, but he was drinking those, and we were talking, we had a good time, we were laughing, telling stories, joking around, sounds like I'm going to hang out with them a little bit more, which is awesome, yeah, I'll, I love hanging out with the guys, I don't get to do it all that often, because obviously, between going to work and nothing else in my life, uh, any time that I can get out of the house right now, I'll love to do it. Maybe here before long, whew, I'll be the one buying the drinks. That'd be nice, huh? As you may or may not notice, I'm driving without my glasses. It's kind of a trial. I want to see how bad my eyes actually are. Uh, they're bad. I won't be doing this on the regular. And, uh, yeah. Gotta go home and get my wife a chicken sandwich from Hardee's. And aside from that, talked to my youngest sister for about half an hour and I had a great conversation with her. Uh, she's going to be going to Iowa State next Wednesday. So kids are going back to school. Get ready for it. I know I'm not. Anyway, um, yeah, it was just, it was a nice day, despite, you know, Kevin, which, you know, I've come to realize something about the whole situation of having to deal with someone like him. He 
must have one of the crappiest home lives of anybody. If he feels the need to come to a place where we don't even like him and want to hang out with us, me and Sean. I know that he's also just trying to do his job, but he does it in such a way that he's not making friends with us. And so he must have one of the most abysmal home lives. If he, wa if he willingly wants to come in and subject him himself to us, knowing, has to realize that we don't like him. I mean, that's, that's truthfully, that is the only excuse I can think for the man. Because otherwise, he's willingly coming to work and subjecting himself to our wrath, oblivious to the fact that we don't like him. And that would be even more devastating to have somebody that's that clueless. Like, seriously. Could be. It freaking could be. I'd feel bad for him, but he does this to himself. It's kind of like, uh, oh, let's say that you have a, a really famous basketball player who made his, uh, it's LeBron James, that's what it is. He made a living on being the best in the game. Kevin is the best rep that we have in the Des Moines area. And he gets bullheaded, head sure, slightly political, starts to piss off some people. And now all of a sudden, there are those that like him, and there are those that hate him. Just like LeBron James. Now, obviously, Kevin isn't the greatest of all time, or trying to claim that he is the greatest of all time, but... He is definitely flopping, at least to us. Anyway, I had something there. I kind of got bad at explaining it. I miss having Ronnie. I miss having Jose. I miss having Brent around. Even if things weren't perfect. They were better than what they are right now. I guess it'll be alright. Keep making money. Yeah. Anyway. Good Friday. Everyone stay safe. Enjoy the fair if you're going. Peace.